I am Shelley van Eck and I um, came here in 2011 for the first time. Fell in love with the stars, landed up in a little guest house, Galileo, um, the, the lady that was running it, Anilia, she was super amazing. She made me feel very comfortable and it was great. And that evening the stars were amazing. In Sutherland, some most nights you don't have to look up, they are all around you. So that's why I fell in love with Sutherland. And then we bought a plot and then we built and then we bought this house. Four years ago. Four years ago uh, we moved and the house was just too big so we turned it into a guest house. All car related because Johan restores vintage vehicles and builds hot rods. So that's how we got into it and it was a first for me, first for him <laughs> and it works, it's good. Johan and I came from Cape Town. Um, we were living out there on a farm also a quiet life, but not so safe. And we moved here for the peace, tranquility and safeness. It is not easy to adapt. We, our altitude is very high. So we've got drier air here, um, which, so you, you take strain in the heat and then you take strain in the, in the cold. Our main tourism attraction is petrol heads. Anybody that loves anything to do with V8s uh, combined with cars. Not necessarily cars, but V8s, old school. When we decided on the V8 guest house, it was all Johan. He's the, I call him a car doctor, car artist. I'm not really sure what to call him. He, he has this passion. He's got a picture in his head. He can see an end product where the normal person can't. So he took broken blocks, engine blocks, and turned them into coffee tables. And he took um, wrecks of vehicles and made them pretty and turned them into car beds. So that was all Johan, the white bedding and the, um, the, the, small, the small stuff that was me. And that's normal guest house stuff, but the decor and the, the sleeping in a car bed and the coffee tables, that's all Johan. Johan restores vintage vehicles and he builds hot rods. He does not like to chop a car. A lot of people um, complain about turning a truck into a hot rod, but sometimes you have to because you take a, a truck and you put hundreds of thousands of rands into it and at the end of the day it's, it's not worth that money. Nobody's going to buy it and nobody's going to spend that money. So that's where hot rod comes in. It's a cheaper version of the old original American V8 truck it was originally. And then the, vin the, the restoring of vehicles, he's been doing that for many, many years. He's got a client base based all over the world, which is why we're here. He does not have to be based anywhere specific. Johan has been sourcing the, the wrecks for... Um, Johan and I have been together for 21 years, so approximately 19 years now. He's been sourcing these vehicles all over the country. So he will jump into the backy and take a trailer and um, putt course and he will hit the road and go into the smaller towns, farming areas and um, pick up a old wreck out of a riverbed. Sometimes it can take him two days to get it out and load it and strap it before he actually can get it off the property. So that's the, he, he has a passion because he can see the end product of that specific wreck. We also offer to take people on a workshop tour. My guests that check into the guest house get to go for a free workshop tour. Um, but keeping in mind it does take time. So we, um, because we're involved with the Sutherland animal um, help in the town, we ask for a 50 rand donation or a bag of dog food. There's not much to do here for a lot of guests in Sutherland. So, we decided to take a piece of ground and scrape a, um, a, I can't even call it an oval track because it's not, it's nothing professional. It's originally just for Johan, for the guys, for fun. He's got a Datsun Laurel amongst a few other cars, but the Datsun Laurel is the one that's um, pulled through. She's, she, she's, she's very strong, she's doing well. Um, we take guests and we let them have that experience. They can buy there for the day. Um, no alcohol while driving. 
obviously strict rules and um, it's it's just fun there's nothing professional about it but it's an experience and um, to make a bit of dust and go around the track and do a little bit of stock car driving and drifting people come to Sutherland because of the stars mainly um, the stars are the main attraction and I must admit that they're, they're pretty amazing and um, when people come to my guest house they need to be they need to understand the idea of sleeping in a car bed you're not getting in and out of a normal bed so there is a little bit of um, it's, it's, it's not the most comfortable but once you're in you're in and once you're out you're out it's the whole experience of sleeping in an actual truck and being amongst the, the decor of, of being in a car bed. So if you're that kind of person and you want to be around the cars and you want to experience sleeping in a, in a V8 truck, then you come to my guest house.